There are many safety precautions that should be put into effect when using a tire machine. First of all, and most obviously, you should use, always wear your safety glasses, which is like one of the number one rules in the shop. Um, when inflating a tire, don't put too much pressure. Too much pressure in it, it can explode. Same for all air compressors. Um, while inflating the tire, also watch your fingers, because the tire tends to pop near the end of it, whenever it's almost done. Bead breaker. Never have a bead breaker on the rim. It could severely damage the rim, or it could even, uh, or it could even hurt you. Um, just always wash your fingers too. Uh, don't wear gloves either. Gloves, unless you just want to use it for picking up a tire. As you can see here, we got the tire. Rub around it over the lip right here. And you can hold this in place if you want. And you click this foot pedal down here down. Let's just spin it. Alright, grab this. This tire's not. Okay, maybe we didn't break the beat all the way. Maybe it's just the tire. Are we supposed to push down for it? No. Do it again. Push it down. Yeah. Yeah. All right. So then, we got it. It's all around it. And now, I want to do the same thing to the bottom. It might be a little hard for this tire because I don't know if this is the right size room for this tire or not. This might be the wrong test. What we're going to do is we're going to try to put this down in here. Same around the top. Just going to get to the bottom of it. Like that. And then you're just going to spin it. Same pedal. Just watch it. Let me get that up. After that, the tire is off, bring up the uh, salad, and you got two sets of pieces. Now, we're going to do the reverse. So, what we'll do, we'll tie it back up here, tower back down, and you're going to position it to where this piece Show it, show it. Yeah, hold on. Right. Where this piece over here is over the rim, you're supposed to push on this side. Right here, the tire. I'm gonna show. Just push on this side. So then we are just going to spin it. Keep pushing it down. Push. You gotta push a little harder. It's going reverse. There we go. Then we're gonna have to fix it real fast. Keep pushing it down, such as Troy is doing now. And you're gonna wanna position it to where it's the same around over the lip. You're gonna wanna push down real hard over here. As you can see. Just pushing down real hard. Alright. Back on the rim. Okay. After that, let's see, what else do we have up to do? Um, we want to take this, this off. Just do that. I'll tell you to back up so that that don't go clean up against the wall. Just a little bit of safety there. Alright, so now I believe we're going to want to inflate the tire. That's all we want to do. Okay, here we go. Here's 
show good uh, safety reasons as we did with the deep blade this time. Okay. What you want to do with this is whenever you're inserting it, you just push this little nozzle right here open and then we'll just slide right on there. And you release it, it should be locked on. And right here is your little pressure dial. And this is the pedal for air as you're watching. Now, whenever you push it open, I forgot which one you're doing. What? Because there's two buttons. You push it down. You tell me one? Oh, all right. Yeah. yeah. Are you still coming? Alright. Well, whenever you push down on it, it'll go up to 40. 40 is not how much is inside the tire right now. 40 is how much is being exerted into the tire. And we just wait. I think it's going. Yeah, I think it's going from underneath it. I'm going to do the same as the best thing to go off of me.